Welcome back everyone. So as most of you know by now, since I'm pretty late to this tutorial, Filza has actually came out for some of these unjill broken phones, which is really cool. I'm running it right now on my iPhone 11 on iOS 14.3. Now in order to install it, we're going to pretty much install it like any other you know, side loaded app, but you will have to be between iOS 14 and iOS 14.3. So if I go to general, go on about, you can see 14.3. If you're on 14.4, it doesn't work. You can get it installed, but it doesn't you know, do anything. I've already tried it. So in order to do this, what you want to do is, first of all, be connected to Wi-Fi and all of that stuff. And you want to make your way over to this specific website, which if you're familiar with the other tutorials that I've done pretty recently, it's ipa-app.me. <laughs> I kind of said it wrong, but there's a website up there. I'm not linking it down below because every time I do that, these videos get flagged. So just go ahead and type that into your web browser, preferably Safari because it only works on Safari. So once you get here, there's a bunch of ads all over the place. So just exit out of all of them. And what you want to do is scroll down until you find Plank Falza, which is right here. So you'll see this little app. What you want to do is click the get button, which is right here. And then you'll probably come into an ad, as you can see. So you want to click it again until you get into the next page. You'll come into a page like this. Now you're going to keep getting ads. So you're just going to wait a couple of seconds as you can see another ad. And then you'll see this little skip this ad. You typically have to click it twice. So you'll get here. You want to hop out of here and then you want to click it again. And then you'll get this little pop up. You want to go ahead and click install. Now I've already installed it, so I'm going to ignore it. But you want to click install. And sooner than later, files will actually start installing on your device itself. So it may take a second or two, so you may want to wait a second or you know it's okay. And what you want to do while this, well, when this is done loading, you want to make your way over to your settings app once more, and you'll come into this page. You want to scroll down until you get into general. You then want to scroll all the way down until you get into profiles and device management, which is right here. And then what you want to do is you'll probably only have one, but you want to click on the one that has the files app in it. So the files app typically says APA. I don't know why they just don't keep the name on it. But there's going to be a little trust option up here. You want to click trust. And at that point, you're going to be able to open up files. So when the first time you open it, it will say a little exploiting thing in the, like the middle of the screen and it may reboot your phone. It did it for me on my iPhone 11. So you may have to just let it exploit. It may take a couple of seconds, even a couple of minutes. It took about five minutes for me. But sooner than later, I was able to go ahead and open up files. And as you can see, I have access to pretty much everything that I typically would have on a jailbreaking phone with files in it. So there's a lot of customizability. There's a lot of things you can do with this app. So it's really cool, but that's really pretty much it so far. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button helps me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really discount. So it means so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, I'll up every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.